There has been a rash of terrorizing charges in and around Fargo over the past week. Five people have been charged in five different cases. Kayla Marie Slater of Fargo was facing two felony counts of terrorizing domestic violence. According to court records, on August 3rd, police were dispatched to a Fargo apartment. Witnesses said Slater threatened two different people with text messages that read in part, quote, I will end your effing life along with everyone else, unquote. And Melanie Nicole McRae of Fargo has been charged with uh, felony terrorizing domestic violence. According to court documents, on August 5th, police responded to a disturbance at a Fargo residence. The male victim stated his roommate, McRae, had allegedly been stealing his medications and threatened to kill him in his sleep with a hammer. And Marianne Perez Noriega of Mapleton has been charged with terrorizing domestic violence for an August 4th incident. According to court records, the female victim stated she uh, wound up fighting with Noriega and Noriega punched her multiple times in the face, then grabbed a firearm from one of her bags. The victim ran to another room and called police. Noriega was arrested and a 9mm Luger handgun was seized. And Harka Badur Rai of Fargo has been charged with felony terrorizing domestic violence. According to court documents, police were dispatched to a Fargo apartment for a disturbance. A family member reported Rye had threatened them with a knife and asked for money. And Tyler Lee Well of Fargo has been charged with terrorizing domestic violence. According to court documents, on August 7th, Police were dispatched to a Fargo apartment for a disturbance. A family member reported being choked and held at knife point by Well. I'm Neil Carlson reporting for inews.tv.